All right, guys, so I'm just getting ready to take this thing on its maiden here. Figured we'd go ahead and knock this out together. Now, one thing that I want you to remember is we disconnected the VTX. So I'm going to go ahead and take my tweezers and plug that back in uh, because we need to be able to see and I need to be able to show you how this is going to fly. Now, I am not using goggles here, so I'm just going to do an in-store line of sight uh, just for a quick flight, okay? Nothing more than that. Um, and I'm going to keep this monitor here and try to zoom in on it so that you guys can see it working. All right, so first thing, let's take the LiPo. I just charged it. We're going to put that here. All right, and I'm going to, the way I do my straps on this one is I actually go all the way around the drum. All right, so I'm going to go like this. I'm going to fit this strap right in here. And I'm going to clamp it down really tight here. And it stays, it stays very well when I do this. So there we go. It's not going anywhere. Love it. Perfect. Okay, now, next thing is to do the prop. So remember, I have these turning like the default way. So if you're looking at your props here, right? If the pitch, and we're gonna describe it like this to make this easier. Uh, let's say we have, I'm looking for a flat material. Um, let's take this little manual right here, okay, right? So if you take the props and you hold them in front of you, right, like the manual, and it's tilted up this way, if, 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 it's, if it's going from left bottom to right top, right, like that angle, then that means that it's gonna be pushing air down if it spins to the right. So that's what this is. You can see the angle, if I show you, the angle is left bottom, so it's, going, it's sitting like this, all right? I don't know that's hard to see, but it's sitting like this, or here, let me do it like this instead. So if you look at this right here, you can see the angle, it's sitting like this, which means it's gonna spin this way to the right. So wherever it's open, that's the direction it's turning. This is open this way, so it's gonna spin this way. This is gonna be a right spinning motor or clockwise. So that's gonna go on motor one. And this is another one where it's spinning like this. It's gonna go on motor four. Okay, now, if you notice this prop, it's slanted this way, which means on the left, it's at the top and on the right, it's at the bottom. The left top means it turns to the left, okay? If it's right top, it turns to the right. So left top means the left point is higher than the uh, right point, right? So it's sitting at this angle, which means it's gonna turn this way to cut the wind, okay? So this is gonna be a counterclockwise prop, all right? And that is all she wrote. Now, I'm gonna to try to make sure I don't blow all this stuff all over the place when I try to take off. So let's kind of put some stuff away. Let me get the monitor right here for you. Uh, and let me plug this in and we can make sure that we've got everything running as it should. There we go. Okay. And I will just do this like this. Ooh, it's going to be tough to take off like this, but actually, let me just zoom in on the screen. All right. So you can watch me fly this and you can, well, I'm not going to do anything crazy. I'm not best pilot in the world here but let me set this on my desk okay and let me turn my radio on that probably help okay okay let's wait for it to assign uh, okay we should be ready to go we are okay and here we go I have to turn, I should probably turn the, you know what, I'm gonna bring this back real quick. Woo. I'm gonna turn the VTX up. So this is smart audio right here. So, whoa, let me zoom out real quick. Let me watch what I'm gonna do here, okay? So I'm going to, the, the signal, you could see it kind of blinking, so I'm gonna tell it to put out more power. So to use the smart audio to change your video settings, take your left stick, take your left stick here, go to the center and go left. Take the right stick and, uh, let me see, where, 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 where am I, sorry. Let me exit, okay. Left, and then the right stick, while you're holding this one left, you go up, and it brings up this menu here. And I'm, let me cover the camera so maybe you can see the menu a little bit better. Let me put a little cap on this, and I won't take too long because the VTX is gonna get hot. But this is the menu that comes up, right? And what I wanna do is I wanna go down, and I wanna go to my VTX, and I wanna change my power to, let's say 200, okay? That's gonna give me, 
Yes, I'm gonna confirm it. I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna save and exit. So save and exit. Okay, now that's gonna give me a little bit stronger video. All right, so that we shouldn't hopefully have too much flickering going on. So now let me put this back here and we'll do a real quick flight. Let's do it like this. Let's see if we can maybe not mess this up this time. Okay, ready? And Forget I'm in a metal building, so we can go through a couple things here. Oh, okay. I want to go. Okay, I'm gonna go get that now because um, I can't see the wall where I'm at. Let me see. No, hold on. Be right back. And my poor screen is blinking because, let me see if I can get that wire. Uh, it has no, my battery on my screen does not last very long and I should have probably, there, let me see if I can get it to stay. This is not the drone issue. This is my screen that doesn't have much power. All right, let's see where we're at. Uh, we'll take it for another quick flight. Everything on it looks good. It's ready to go. There you go. Go. There you go. Woo! He is right in my face. Fun drums. I got a lot of you. It's fun. Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> Landed on my table. All right, so, anyways, so it does well. I love it. It's actually pretty fun. Um, I, I prefer. Nah, darn it. I had to hit this lamp. So, I prefer flying line of sight. Uh, I, I just love it more. Um, but it flies great, and it's, I mean, it's durable as heck, you know? Uh, let me see, I think that, I think that pretty much do it for the flying test. Uh, I really do like it. I mean, this is a strong drone. It really is a strong drone. Um, I don't know, let me see how much battery, oh, I'm doing good on battery. Shoot, I didn't realize that. Uh, let me see if I can maybe take it for one more. There we go. All right. Woo! -wee. There you go. Guys, I love it, okay? The drone is fabulous. To be honest with you, I think it's awesome. Uh, I mean, motors are, are great. 
So let me let me let me not zoom in so much now. Um, sorry, I know I had a couple little accidents there, but I mean, I, look, I like flying line of sight. It's more fun for me. Let me put my monitor back up. Um, and uh, but there are areas here uh, where you can't see. Like I mean, it's like literally back there. Um, so, anyways. That's a drone right there, guys. That's everything set up like it is with, with, with stock settings. Let me turn this off real quick. Um, cannot complain. I think this is a, I think it's an awesome build. Uh, I think anybody who gets it in analog is going to love it. It's an easy build. Uh, it doesn't weigh much. Uh, and I think, I'll see, let me see the weight with everything on it. 82 grams uh, with everything on it, including LiPo strap. Um, that's with the 550. Uh, added it, it will be oops about 138 somewhere around 138 not bad at all okay so uh, let's see where we're at all right so that's where we're at guys so you if you finish this series and you've got this done and you're ready to fly congratulations to you this is an awesome drone I love it uh, it was a, it was a fun design it's probably our, one of our best selling frames ever right now um, it is very strong the frame whether it is the analog or the digital both frames are identical and so if you saw that video where it's supporting the front left tire of my Denali look I don't care if that's 5,000 or 2,000 pounds that's my mom I gotta tell her like that um, whatever it is the fact is it holds a ton of weight for something that is that small I hope you guys enjoyed if you have any questions you can hit me up always enjoy the uh, enjoy the DIY plus kit if that's what you're doing uh, and God bless guys be safe and fly safe okay we'll talk to you soon and uh, if you get time, please always subscribe to our channel. Talk to you later, guys. Safe flying. Peace.